Hello, my name is Sarah Payne and I'm going to show you a little feature that you might not know about some embroidery machines, um, that you can actually turn some of the embroidery designs into applique designs and if you've got a machine like a scan and cut you can actually cut them out with your scan and cut and then come back and sew them on your, uh, your machine. So um, I do have a brother, this is the M230E here that we're having a look at. Um, and you can see I've got my screen, I'm just going to turn that slightly. So this is where the built-in designs are. Now um, you have to pick your designs very carefully when you play around with this because they need to be very simple shapes with single lines. It's no good picking a very fancy design because as soon as you put that into a cutting machine, the cutting machine is going to try and cut out those thread lines and you'll just end up with a pile of mush. But um, it's quite a useful thing to do with shapes like this. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take you into um, your basic shapes here and you can see with this machine we've got 10 different options. I'm going to go heart shape. Now we can only use this technique with a heart that's got a straight edge. Again if I was to use one of these ones with the fancy decorative edges what's actually going to happen is it's just going to go do -do 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 and you end up with mush. So I'm just going to move through. There is a stitch in here, stitch number 10 or design number 10 that's just a straight line. So there we go, we've selected our straight line and I'm going to set it as an embroidery. So at the moment, if we went and embroidered this, we are going to get a stitched heart. But what we're going to do is we're going to come over here to the threads option and I have all of these colours, but we want to move through the colours to the very end. So I'm just going to move through those options. You can see here there's four pages of colours, so I'm just going to keep going. Right, now at the bottom, the very end, there are three little options here, one of which has got a pair of scissors on it. So I'm going to select that. Now what this is doing is it's turning this shape into an applique shape. So you could stitch this out and cut it out by hand, but what's so clever is if you've got a cutting machine, you can save this to a USB, pop it in your cutting machine, and your cutting machine, like your scan and cut, will actually cut that shape out for you. So all I'm going to do now is go OK, and then I would choose to save that option. Now if I have a USB, we pop a USB key into the side of your machine um, and you will save to that. When you then go to your scan and cut and you, you plug that USB into your scan and cut, it will go, oh, cutting file and it will allow you to cut it out in the normal way. Um, I don't have a USB here, so I'm just going to save it to there. But then what we can do is um, we can take that file. You could have resized it if you wanted to. You just make sure that um, whatever you've resized it to, that's what you come to stitch later on. So once I've got my cutting design um, onto my scan and cut or other cutting machine, um, it will then cut that out. I can then come back to my embroidery machine. I would stitch this now. I would go back and change from that to a colour. So we'll just take it away and make it black again. So let's just go back. There we go. Or in this case, pink doesn't really matter. We would stitch that onto a fabric. Leave that fabric in the hoop, but lay your cut shape over the top of it and then come back in here and stitch it again, um, but stitch it over the top of your applique. And there you go. That's how you can take a basic shape like this from your embroidery machine, turn it into a cutting file, use your scan and cut to cut that element out and then uh, bring it back into your stitched work again. So you can do this with some of the fonts, anything that's basically a solid outline, you can do that with, with your embroidery machine.